felt despicable, so I bought out the theater. without their goggles. Taking over TikTok. 
So you probably noticed a bunch of people with this profile picture. They're all members of something called the Minion Cult. Now what Minion Cult members are supposed to do is change their profile picture to this, and you're supposed to follow and reply to every single other Minion Cult member you see with the banana emoji. That's in comment sections or on your FYP. Now if you want to join, just screenshot this and set it as your picture. And you can repost this video to spread the cult. Let's get the Minion Cult to take over TikTok. Minions Rise of Guru is becoming one of the biggest movies ever. So the new Minions movie just broke box office records by opening with $129 million. And by Sunday, the movie is expected to surpass $200 million. Now a lot of the reason why this movie is doing so good is probably because of all of the memes and the entire cult dedicated just to Minions. Which if you want to join that cult, just set this as your profile picture. Follow everyone you see with that profile picture. And respond bananas to all of their comments. Imagine if Minions ends up passing in-game or Avatar. Okay, who let the Minions TikTok in here? No, no! Hey, what's up Minions TikTok? <laughs> Love the mic. Is that a banana? <laughs> I'm just kidding, banana boy, banana boy. <laughs> but like, speaking of bananas, who's your favorite minion? You like Stuart? <laughs> ba 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 banana. <laughs> that one-eyed weirdo. Not gonna lie to you, you're like the only Stuart stan I know. I'm Team Kevin. Two eyes and tall. <laughs> Sorry, I can't help it. I'm a minion girl. <laughs> Do you want to see some of my fan art? I don't know. I feel like you'd really appreciate some good minion fan art. So, like, I'm not allowed to go to real art school, so please don't judge. I have to spend all my time working on nuclear weapons for grill. The same old usual. You know me. You know me. <laughs> but not a boy. But not a boy. But, like, here you... 
No, that one is, pretend that does not exist. Pretend, this is, I, this is the one that I wanted to show you. I work really hard on my art. Like, this is, no, not, okay, let's just pretend that never happened, right? Banana boy, banana boy. <laughs> but like, honestly, if you smell bananas right now, it's kind of because I farted. And like, every time I fart, it smells like bananas. Sorry, you can't help it, minion girl. <laughs> Banana boy, banana boy. Do you smell like bananas? Just kidding, it's me. Take a sniff. I always smell like bananas because I love minions. Who's your favorite? My favorite's Bob. He has two eyes and he's dummy thick. Do you want to see some of my minion fan art? Banana boy, banana boy. Okay, but it's a little bit embarrassing. Here's called Self Love and I drew it all by myself. The next one is called Banana Party. This is my dreams and aspirations for the future. I want Gru to turn me into one of his loyal minions. My body's already 30% transformed, but I'm not gonna tell you which part. But out of a boy, but out of a Here's the easiest way to draw a minion. For our first step, let's draw a shape of a letter N. Next, we're gonna draw two ovals right in the middle, just like so. And then one more for his eye. Next, we're gonna draw his goggles by drawing a rounded rectangle on each side. Now let's draw two curved lines for his smiley face. For our last few steps, let's draw this shape for his overalls. Then let's draw a line for his arm. Finish up with two lines for his overall strap. And then boom, you're all done. Sorry, we can't. Oh! I just wanted to thank you for this. You work like a charm. Eric, let me cut to the chase here. I did the genius bed scientist. You want to come work for me? No, I am done with villainy. Off to happier horizons. Oh. Goodbye, little chap. Then I All right, all right, fine. Stop with the face. I'm in. Want to see something cool? Oh, So sorry I didn't mean to wake you, but now that you're up, could I ask you something? No, go to sleep. It's like, it's really important. <sighs> what? I hate you. Hey, guess what song I'm humming? <laughs> Up, Shania Twain. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah. You go, you go, you go. Would you come over and check up on it? I'ma let you work up on it. Ladies, while they check up on it, watch it while they check up on it. Ladies, while they check up on it, chilling on me tonight. That was pr that was pretty good. Right? That was good. We should we should start a band or something. Yeah, yeah, totally. We come up with like a really cool band name or something. <laughs> yeah, totally. I don't know. Totally. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Down. <laughs> hey, you want to go out somewhere with me? No. Well, maybe we can go to the movies or something. Oh my, you're like a needy little baby. I don't want to be seen with you. Get out. Hey, um, I was going to go to the mall or something. Do you want to go? With me? Uh, 
I'm kind of busy. I could take you to Taco Bell, too. My treat. I'm your only friend, aren't I? <laughs> yeah. Sad. Yeah, I'll go with you. Cool. Hello? Here's your guys' food. Oh, thanks. Thank you. Oh, damn. What? I asked for no cilantro, but there's cilantro. Oh, I'll just call the waitress back over. We'll send it back. No! Why? It's fine. It's... I... It's fine. What do you mean? You hate cilantro. It's no big deal. For the love of God, please stop. It's no big deal. Yes, it is, okay? You call the waitress over, okay? She comes over. I tell her she screwed up my meal. Now she's embarrassed. She hates us, okay? She goes back to the kitchen. She tells Jimmy, the line cook, who screwed up my meal, to recook my meal, okay? He was on strike two with his manager, and now he's fired, okay? So he goes home to his pregnant wife and his toddler, Timmy, right? And he has to tell them that he's fired now, okay? He was also two years sobriety, and now he's back to the drink. This is getting kind of dark. Fast forward two months, his wife's had the baby, but Jimmy's drunk all the time, so she leaves him. Listen, and now Timmy the toddler grows up without a dad. He's an adult oh. now, and he has nothing but resentment for his father. But why does he have that resentment, Kendra? Because of cilantro Karen at the restaurant 20 years previous where his dad got fired, okay? So now he grows up, and now his sole purpose in life is to find cilantro Karen, a.k.a. me, and kill me. Are you done? Yes, I am done, and I'm gonna eat this cilantro-filled meal so Timmy can grow up with a dad, okay? How's everything tasting? So good. Great. You need therapy. Yeah, I know.